Hello and welcome to this series. Um, we're going to be exploring the world of rhythm using everyday objects and uh, essentially what you learn from this is some basic concepts of rhythm um, but how to play them using everyday found sound. Okay, I have a bucket, I have a book, we've got spoons, if you don't have drumsticks, I also have drumsticks of course, which I might be using. I've got one small thali and one big thali. I've kept the small one in the center of the big one and I'm primarily going to be using the middle sound and the side. So the idea is how many different sounds can we incorporate. So we've got metal, two different metals. If you want to be more stylish, you can add one more, maybe a glass and you've got three metals now. You'll see each one has a distinct sound that is called the timbre of the instrument, the different unique sound that some instrument will create. For example, just a glass alone, you have a resonant sound. And I'm controlling that resonance. So different no resonance, but another sound on top. Or so, depending on what object you find, first explore its sound. I've got a bucket here. Beautiful for hand drums. So side always explore center side then you always find something interesting and then maybe the body of course the book and the table so First, let's begin with a basic pulse. Okay, what is a pulse? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four numbers. Imagine now this is my hand which is going to play in between each of these numbers. So I've got one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one two three four one and two and three What did I do? I didn't play all the ands. I played sometime one and and then sometime I didn't play. Oh, 
I reversed the order, this became one. All of these combinations are possible. So now, just playing with the pulse. You see, you have to move and you have to create different patterns. When the sounds follow each other in different patterns, they make different um, grooves. For example, one and one and two and three and four 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 and and two and three and four and and two and three and four and one and two and stop. One. Now I have added an element of stop to this pulse. So that's the lesson one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Any element that you have as your sound. Make use of them. If you are having difficulty in finding the right pattern, just start with one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And one. So have fun with this. Thank you for watching.